Brewster County Sheriff's Office seeing a larger amount of illegal immigrants than normal, especially through the town of Marathon, causing the Sheriff's Office to increase patrols in that area. Good evening. I'm Katie Orth. And I'm Eddie Flores. Big Two's Caleb Califano talked to the Sheriff today about why this could be happening and what solutions there might be. Caleb? Well, guys, Sheriff Ronnie Dodson tells me he can't put an exact number on the increase of illegal immigration in Brewster County, but he says it's the most he's seen in a long, long time. Across the Trans-Pecos, sheriffs on the border say they're seeing more illegal immigration than normal. All the pressure they're putting down in the valley, out in Arizona area, is kind of pushing them this way. Just like Tarot County, right next door in Brewster County, they're seeing the same problem. With the sheriff's office sharing a post on Facebook stating it's become especially bad in the town of Marathon. You know, for the past at least 60 days, it's been, you know, just a lot more than we're normally seeing. And in the last few days, there's been a lot end up in Marathon. And a lot of the citizens have been going you know, to want to know, you know, what's happening, what's going on. Because of this, the sheriff's office has since increased patrols around town. I guess they've closed a the trail down someplace and they've opened it up on us. Illegal border crossings aren't new in Brewster County, but the amount of people trying to get across is what catches Sheriff Dodson's eye. It's definitely increased more than we've seen in, in a long, 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 long time. Dodson says there's multiple reasons why he thinks the increase in illegal immigration might be happening. But when it comes to solutions, while he doesn't want to see areas like Big Ben and the Rio Grande destroyed by a wall, he does believe they need to let Border Patrol do their job the right way. Unhandcuff the Border Patrol let the, and hire some, get some more body men and boots on the ground out here to try to combat the situation. Now, Sheriff Dodson says if he sees, if anyone sees any unusual activity around the Marathon area, to call 911 as soon as possible. Live in the control room, Caleb Califano, Big Two News.